What is up guys? It is Joe here from Joe Talks Wrestling and I'm in a very weird um, place right now. I'm in the car. You know, I don't think you've really seen me record in the car before. Um, however, I've come to you with something to talk about. The WWE Championships are now using Velcro instead of traditional snaps on their titles, which is really confusing. Uh, the title of this video should be why are WWE using Velcro on their belts? And we're going to be looking into a reason, a couple of reasons why that could be. Um, I mean, initially it was on the women's belts. I believe they started in 2018 at about SummerSlam when Ronda won the belt. That was when they first put the Velcro on. And I've been doing some research and I've seen that normally you put Velcro on the belts if they're not fitting the wrestler like properly, but it's only a temporary thing. However, now the both the women's belts have them then after wrestlemania the universal title had it i don't know if it's on the wwe championship yet but after watching takeover 25 last night for nxt which was fantastic all of the nxt belts now have velcro on as well and it's just why it takes away from it like big time they the other side still has snaps on so it's like, how are you Velcroing it together if you've still got snaps on the other side? Have they covered over them snaps and put Velcro? But if they have them, why are they still got the snaps on like the outside of the strap? It's really weird, but is what it is. Um, I believe what it is is because they look like the toy belts. I believe a reason could be WWE are trying to sell the toy belts more. So they've made them more realistic by putting Velcro on the real belts and on the toy belts. It's a, definitely a possibility for something that could happen. Um, other than that, all the guys are like a bit smaller nowadays that are champions. If you look at it, you've got NXT champions like Johnny Gargano, uh, Adam Cole now. Then Seth Rollins, Kofi Kingston, they're not the largest guys in the world. Um, the women aren't, obviously. So their Velcro makes sense. But... The men that are quite smaller, it does kind of make sense for them to have Velcro on. The one that I'm a bit like, hang on a minute about, is uh, Velveteen Dream. He's the NXT North American champion. He doesn't need Velcro on his belt. It should fit him perfectly. Like, it's, it's weird. But anyway, tell me what you guys think about it in the comment section down below. I am not a fan of this at all. Not at all. WWE should go back to snaps. I swear to God, if I see a WWE replica belt being released by WWE with Velcro on, other than the Daniel Bryan Eco Friendly Championship, obviously, but no one's going to buy that anyway. But if I see a WWE replica with Velcro on, if they start converting the replica belts to Velcro, people are going to be pissed. That's just that's this the best way to put it. So I do hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a like, comment, and subscribe. I've been Joe from Joe Talks Wrestling. You guys have been awesome. Stay tuned for more wrestling content, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.